am Thelma Gerbolingo, student intern from the University of Bohol. Today, I am going to show you my teaching demonstration in English 5. My topic is all about cause and effect. Good morning, grade 5. How are you this morning? Wow, good to hear that. Okay, please arrange your chair properly and pick up the piece of paper. So before we start our discussion this morning, let's have our prayer first. Anna, can you lead a prayer? Okay, let us put ourselves in the presence of the Lord, in the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, so let me check your attendance first. So, say present if your name is called. Anna, Yana, wow, no one is absent today. Very good. So, I see a lot of happy faces today and I am happy too. Always remember our classroom rules. So, what are these rules? First is be kind. So, you need to be kind to your classmates. Second is work. Work together. Third is follow directions. Fourth is listen to teacher. And the last one is wait your turn to speak. So this time, I am going to show you a video clip. And I want you to watch and understand the video. Am I clear? Okay. Several provinces in Messiah suffer severe flooding following heavy rains brought by Typhoon Ursula Wednesday, December 25. Ursula makes landfall five times from December 24 to 25 and brings heavy flooding in Barangay Linoan, Ormok City, Leite, Balasan, Iloino, Barangay Mainda, Quartero, Capiz, and President Rojas, Capiz. Typhoon Ursula also leaves a trail of destruction in several parts of eastern and western Messiahs. In Capiz, the typhoon damages Lantanan Elementary School, Dumalang Municipal Hall, and the Robinson's Mall in Rojas. Houses in Tacloban City are also damaged by the wind and rain. The Christmas tree in the city plaza of Ormoc Leyte falls down. Roads in Naval Binilan are blocked by uprooted trees. The Municipal Hall of Salcedo, Northern Samar, is also badly damaged. Follow Rapper.com for updates. Okay, so what have you observed in the video? Or what have you noticed from the video? Yes, Kiara. Wow, great. It's a typhoon. So when the typhoon happened? Yes, very good. So what are the affected areas brought from the, from the typhoon? Yes, Anna. Wow, excellent. So, as you can see in the video, several provinces in Visayas were suffered severe flooding brought by Typhoon or Sula, right? So, the typhoon was happened last December 25, 2019. So, the typhoon or Sula brings heavy flooding and destructions in several parts of Eastern and Western Visayas, like in Ormoc City, Leyte, Balasan, Iloilo, and Capiz. So the typhoon damages Lantangan Elementary School, Municipal Hall, and Robinson Hall Mall. So houses in Tacloban are also damaged by the wind and rain. So many of people were affected in the typhoon or solar, right? So who can share here in class your experience about typhoons? Anyone? Yes, very good. So in that video, what are or what is the possible reason why are there floods during the typhoon? And what are the effects of typhoon? So you are free to share your ideas here in class. Yes, Antoinette. Yes, very good. 
Massive rainfall. What else? Ria. Yes, very good. Overflowing of the rivers. What else? Gino. Yes, collapse dam. So next, what else? Jisa. Yes, snow melt. How about Jerwin? Yes, deforest. Station. How about you, Jin? Yes, if climate change. So those are the possible reasons why there are floods during the typhoon. How about the effects? So what? who can give me the effects of flooding? Yes, Ruby. Yes, very good. Loss of leaves, buildings, and other structures like bridges canals and roadways so what else yes edward very good so destroy our houses on and buildings how about the others who can answer yes just again contaminate and drinking water very good so what else who can who want to volunteer yes maridi Yes, lead to disease. So, in the in, in our topic or in our uh, in the video, what do you think is our topic this morning? Yes, anyone? Okay, Honey Bell. Yes, it cause and effect. So our lesson for this morning is all about cause and effect. So, in your idea, what is cause and what is effect? Okay, let's go first for the cause. Okay, what do you think is cause, Jean? Well, very good. So, the cause is the reason or... So, wait for a while... Okay, the cause is the reason or why is something happened very good. So, how about the effect? Yes, Hazel. Very good. So, the effect is the result or consequences or consequence what happened. So, I am here. An example, then identify the cause and effect of the sentence. Are you ready? Yes. So here, the first example. Okay, for a while. I will transfer this first. Okay, so the first example is, okay, anyone can read the sentence? Okay, so the cookies are warning because I forgot to set the timer. Okay, Hannibal, what do you think is the cause of the sentence? Who, you can, who can give? Or, yes, Hannibal, you want to answer? Okay, very good. So the cause is, I forgot to set the timer. Very good. How about effect? Hazel. Okay, very good. The cookies are burning. The cookies are burning. Very good. So here, another example of sentence. Okay, so the student could not go to school because of the heavy rain. So who can identify what is, uh, where is the effect and the cause of the sentence? Yes, Priya. Very good. So the cause is because of the heavy rain. How about the effect of the sentence? Yes, very good. 
So the student could not go to school because, oh, I mean the student could not go to school. And the cause is because of the heavy rain. So to further understand the lesson, I will group you into I will group group you into five. So the first row will be the group one, group two, group three, group four, and group five. So this is what you are going to do. So I will give you a party, particular topic that you want to perform and act it out in front of the class. Do you copy? Yes, very good. So, the group one will be the global warming. So, the group two is landslide. And the group three is air pollution. And the group four is water pollution. And the group five is Amazon fire. So, one thing I mean, I'll give you five minutes to prepare. Am I clear? Okay. So, one thing that you should remember is this group that will perform best shall 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 win in the role play and get extra points so understood okay this will be the criteria of your performance during the role play okay so the first is the accuracy and availability of rule. And the last and the second one is clarity of speech. And the third one is expression in body language. And the last one is knowledge and game. Okay, I'll give you five minutes. Five minutes only. Okay. So, whose group will perform first? Okay, group one. Here in front. Very good. Group two. Excellent. Group three. Very good. Group four. Great job. Great group five. Very good. Okay, take note class. I have also here some words or the signal word that you can easily identify the cause and effect of the sentence. Are you ready? Okay, so the first signal words of the cause is of the cause, okay. The cause is as. So this is the first word or the signal word of cause. Next one is owing to. Next is because. Due to. Next is since. So these are the signal words of the cause. Okay, let's go to the effect. So this will be the signal words of the effect. So first is so. Second is therefore. Third is consequently. Fourth is which is why. And the last one is if. Okay, so these are the signal words or the easy words that you can easily identify the cause and effect of the sentence. 
Okay, do you understand now? Okay, okay class, what have you learned on the topic that you recently act out? So, how are you going to save our Mother Earth? Can you give us some ways to protect our Mother Earth? Okay, how about Jerwin? Can you give me the ways that you can, we can save our Mother Earth? Yes, very good. To conserve a uh, water. So, the less water you use, the less runoff of wastewater that eventually end up, end, end up in the ocean. How about Maridi? Can you give me? Very good. So, shop wisely. So, buy less plastic and bring a reusable shopping bag. How about Edward? Very good. So this is very important to us to do. To plant a tree because trees provide food and oxygen. So they help save energy and clean the air and they help combat climate change. So how about Hazel? Okay, very good. The three R's. What is the three R's? So the reduce, reuse, and recycle. So we must follow the R's to conserve the natural resources and then fill space. So now that we tackled the cause and effect, how is it important our daily living or an our daily living? Yes. Ria, very good. So for us to determine how various phenomena relate in terms of origin and result. Also, to follow us to look carefully at the consequences of character's action and to think about how different action might have different effects. Good job, everyone. Okay, so let's review a short review. So in the lesson that we tackled, any question or clarification? Okay, so always remember that cause is cause is the reason or why is something happen. Well, the effect is a result or or consequence. What? Happen and you always remember the signal words for you to easily identify the cause and effect in the, in the sentence. So this is the signal word. Take note. Okay. So any question or clarification? Okay. Let's proceed to another activity. So since you already know well the topic, let's have another individual activity. Are you ready? Okay, so this will be your activity. So I have here a strip of paper with a sentence and I want you to examine each sentence, put all the cause under the word cause and all effect under the words effect. Do you copy? Okay, want to volunteer? Yes, Mari D. Okay, so. So this will be the first word or the first sentence. Here, so okay, please read Mari here. Okay, so I grow, uh, I grow an inch last year, and now my pants are too short. Okay, Mari, what is cause in the sentence? Yes, very good. I grow an inch last year, and the effect is, and now my pants. Are two short. Okay. Who can volunteer? 
Yes, Hazel. Okay, so here, the second one. So the when hurricane came, we put the chairs into the shed. Yes, what do you think is the cause in the sentence? Yes, very good. When hurricane came, and the effect is we put the chairs into the shed. So another example, another sentence. So Kara's dress was wrinkled. So here, mother ironed it. So Kara's dress was wrinkled, so her mother ironed it. So what do you think is the cause in the sentence? Very good. So Kara's dress was wrinkled. How about the effect? Very good. So here, so her mother ironed it. So another set of sentence here. Okay, for a while. Sally took out. Okay, Sally took out her art box because because she wanted to paint. Okay, what do you think is the effect of the sentence? Yes, Hannibal. Okay, so Sally took out her art box. And the cause is because she wanted to paint. Okay, so I have here, um, I want you, or in your next activity, I want you to answer using your using this worksheet. This worksheet, so this will be individual output. So I'll give you 10 minutes to answer. Am I clear? Okay, 10 minutes is up. Okay, pass your paper in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I will no longer accept paper who are late. Very good. I hope you learn from me something today. So in your assignment, write a short paragraph about a certain problem you encountered and write down the cause and effect. Do you understand? Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Great fight for your participation and for listening today. That's all for today. Great fight. Thank